Hey, what's up guys? I'm Skip and you're watching High Volts Gaming. Today's episode, we're playing some spin tires and as you can see here, we got a Chevrolet, a Ford, and a Dodge Mega Mud Truck in front of us. We're going to put them to the test today. We are on the Proving Grounds map. So we have all kinds of different terrain that we can play with. Big sandy area with a lake, a bushy meadow, and we can use that. And then we have this big, nice swamp pit area over here. So this is probably going to be a really good mud bogging video. We're going to uh, put these three to the test. Now I do believe they're all made by the same exact guy, uh, which is Big T Max. Um, I'm not 100% sure on that, but if one is made by somebody else, let me know down in the comment section below. They all look very familiar, uh, you know, very similar. They're all built in the same way with the same sort of look and textures. So uh, anyway, I know that uh, Big Team Axe built this for because it just came out a minute ago. That's why I was just looking at it on the page. The other two have been out for a little while, so it's not just fresh on the top of my head. But anyway, we're going to go ahead and get this kicked off with the Ford F-350 Black Rock. Now this truck was modeled after a real vehicle. You can actually check him out on uh, Instagram and Facebook. Uh, just search for BlackRock, I guess. Um, he left a comment in the last video that I did and left all the information there. You can find it that way as well. So you can see here, big, huge mud truck. No problem with the little lake area there. Oh, we're gonna wreck it. So let's see here. I also want to do a little pulling challenge with these trucks. I have the other 6x6 six six out in the field here. Let's see if we can hook to that and see what it'll do. There we go. thing just towers over that semi truck <laughs> all right let's go ahead and hook up the winch here not that button click right here click it off acceleration and on to pull that means this truck behind it will just be along for the ride it won't be helping out no problem there <laughs> Wanted to snatch on it, but it was already rolling, no problem. Go ahead and pull it right through the water pit here. Not even slowing down. Fourth gear, what's that? What happened there? There we go. What happened to my fourth and fifth gear? Doesn't want to pull in fourth gear. I don't know why. Kind of weird. It's definitely squatting down with the pressure of that truck behind it. Good look there. Let's go ahead and just pull this thing right on over to the mud pit area. Because I don't think we need to do that with the other two vehicles. It's just going to drag it around no problem. And where it might have a little bit of problem is in the mud pit. Go straight on over to the swamp section we go. That's really weird that it's not wanting to pull when I get it out of third gear. Uh-oh. Did you do hit something back there? <laughs> get unstuck, truck. Let's go. We don't have time to be waiting around for stuck trucks on trees. It's one thing that, that does drive me crazy in this game. You hit a little tree log like that, it just really seems to uh, really slow down your progress or whatever. Really. You know, upset the mood of the trail, you're just cruising along, and all of a sudden you got a tree that you just can't get over. Like, what the heck, man? But anyway. Alright, well, let's just not want to pull that anymore. We're just going to leave it right there. Oh, unhook, please. That's the wrong side. There we are. Alright, come on. We want to throw this thing in the swamp area. All this through here is the swamp, swamp area of this uh, Proving Grounds map. And for you guys that don't know, the Proving Grounds is just the uh, kind of a um, you know an area that used to be used to be like the dev demo where you got your little tools up here where you can actually act like it's a garage anywhere. 
you know, uh, basically right here, click on garage. So any add-ons, I can go ahead and add them on there, change the tires or whatever. I can refill the fuel tank. And I can also just spawn in other vehicles here too. So if I wanted to spawn in this Dodge, click on it over there, click add. Click add, and there's, there's that mod as well. So that's pretty cool. And you can find it, of course, right under the... Um, right under the play tab in the main spin tires menu is how you get to the proving ground so if you've ever seen it there and not not clicked on it and checked it out this is this is it right here it's got some pretty cool different sort of testing areas I think that's about it for the Ford on that one let's go ahead and get our other vehicles over here lock it on in See if I can get a little bit of air off of this hill right here. Ooh, not quite a little bit, a little bit. Fifth gear, pull. Whoa! Go bunny hop for the dodge. Blast through there, no problems. There's the onboard camera. Whoa, pushing, pushing hard. There we go. Hey, what's up, F-350? This thing is just devouring the mud with those big, giant tractor tires on there. No problem at all. Unlock those diffs and see if we can get to slide around a little bit. <laughs> I don't think tractor tires are meant to drift. Meant to donut either. Go ahead and grab the South Rising four-door Chevy Silverado. Rocking the big block as you can hear. This one's got the extra wide sort of tractor tires on it. I am a Chevy guy, so this would probably be one of my favorites right here. Absolutely love this truck. Whoa! <laughs> and I and I wreck it. And I think we could just click. Uh, no. Garage. <laughs> you can make it nighttime. What is? What? What the heck? I thought it would reset it up there, but it's not going to go. Alright, let's try that again. This time just as fast. So, I said we're going to put these things to the test, and they're all pretty well evenly matched. You know, they all uh, have big giant tires on them, big huge mega mud trucks. So I guess the question really is, what is your preference? You know, which one do you like? Are you a Ford guy? Are you a Chevy guy? Or are you rocking that, uh, those uh, big ram horns on your ride? Let me know down in the comment section below. Myself, I'm driving my little Chevy 1500 around every day. Uh, extended cab, 305, five-speed truck. Regular little two-wheel drive. Little daily ride. You know, little road warrior. section below. What are you driving or what would you like to be driving? Which one of these three trucks would you like to see yourself at the mud hole in? Let's <laughs> see if we can get a good ending shot here. There we go. Three absolutely awesome trucks. I'd like to be riding in either one of them, any one of them. That's for sure, guys. Don't forget to smash that thumbs up button. I'm Skip and I'll see you in the next episode. Peace.